we're here with Corrie's PC World and we've headed over to the Essex coastline. To talk about Sonos's new breakthrough portable speaker, the Sonos Move. Yes. Do you mind if we do this inside? Good idea. <laughs> Now, it would be really easy to assume that this is just a, a bigger version of the Sonos One, but it's actually completely different. Yeah, so one of the big differences between the Move and the rest of the Sonos range is that it's got a weather-resistant design. So it has an IP56 rating, which means that it's protected against rain, snow, dust, salt spray, UV, and extreme temperatures, both hot and cold. You mentioned an IP56 rating. What does that actually mean? So an IP rating is given to all electrical appliances to show how equipped they are for dealing with different elements, such as dust or water. How is it protected against kids? Mm, what do you mean? Well, <laughs> when my niece and nephew come to visit, they really like to put their sticky fingers on literally any new stuff that I've got. Um, I've already lost two speakers to ketchup-related incidents. Well, you'll be pleased <laughs> to know that ketchup is one of the elements it's protected against. This thing is really durable. No matter where you decide to listen, you don't need to worry about the conditions getting in the way, which is great. I think that's really important for a portable speaker. How does it deliver on sound? Given it's portable, it's actually got a really impressive sound. So it's got plenty of depth with a wide, far-reaching soundscape and deep bass. And crucially, it automatically bounces the audio to suit its environment. Ah, so kind of like other Sonos devices where you can uh, calibrate it to the room that it's in. Exactly like that. So it's actually got an updated version of the same software. Auto TruePlay is actually built in with the integrated microphones in the speakers. So that's going to adapt what you're listening to to where you're listening. I didn't know it had a microphone. So does that mean that it supports voice control as well then? Google Assistant and Alexa are actually built into the device. So all you have to do is connect it to Wi-Fi and you're good to go for hands-free listening. Brilliant. And if you're somewhere like this where we haven't got Wi-Fi, can you still stream your music? You can connect the device via Bluetooth, so then you're good to go and you can carry on blasting out your tunes. Also, you've got the integrated touch controls on the top, so you can use those, voice controls or the app. Now, obviously, it's got a battery built in or it wouldn't be a portable speaker, so what kind of usage can you get from a full charge? 10 hours of continuous play, so that should be more than enough to keep your party going late into the night. Nice. <laughs> Do you know what I will say? I'm a really big fan of the charging base that's included. I think that's cool. Yeah, you can charge using the base or also a compatible USB-C charger. Only thing for me that's missing, and I think it's kind of quite surprising for a portable speaker, is there's no carry handle. Just because you can't see it doesn't mean it's not there. The Sonos Move is ready to grab and go in an instant. Ah. Oh, you won't mind if I borrow it then? Hey! <laughs> <laughs> if you want to get your hands on the Sonos Move, visit Curry's PC World online or in-store. Amy! Amy!